buying a new home is a major decision, and you'll want to be sure you're protecting what is likely your biggest investment. We get with an expert to talk about homeowners insurance. People are moving back into the city for closer access to workplaces and for the convenience. It's the new trend in urban apartment homes, and we'll visit one locale to see what it's all about. Your new home is under construction, and you are excited about the day you can finally move in. But is it termite proof? Just because it's new doesn't mean termites won't attack. We'll show you what to do to protect your new home. This is the show all about you and your space, your home and surroundings. We are Designing Spaces. Your home may be your biggest single investment and you want to do everything you can to protect it. You have fire insurance, flood insurance, even earthquake insurance, but how do you insure your home from termite attack that can cause up to $5 billion damage in the U.S. annually? And if you live in southern states that have high termite pressure, this becomes even more important. Termite risk is a real concern for homeowners in just about every state across the U.S., and termite prevention measures are especially important in regions of the country where the climate creates a higher risk environment. Even in regions with moderate to lower termite pressure, homeowners still need protection and can benefit from preventative measures. Well, there are two main types of termites that can damage your structure. There are subterranean termites that come into the structure from the ground and then they move into the structure, infest your wood, but then they go back to the ground. And then there's dry wood termites that enter from above ground and they spend the rest of their life in there in the galleries that they make. Homeowners have multiple options to protect their homes from termite damage. The first step is always call a professional pest management expert to inspect your home. A trained professional can determine if there is termite activity, and if so, which type of termite is invading your home. They can also spot conditions in your home that favor termite activity so that they can be corrected. Whether you currently have termite activity in your home or want to prevent your home from getting termites, a pest management professional, or PMP, is essential in providing the options for either scenario. For subterranean termites, these options include a liquid termite treatment, or a termite baiting treatment. There's the liquid termiticide treatment that's applied to the exterior perimeter of your home. There's also a bait option that's also applied to the perimeter of your home. And then there's the combination of the two. Having an understanding of these can help to determine which option or combination of options is best. The Trelona ATBS, or Advanced Termite Baiting System, it's the newest baiting system on the market today. Small plastic stations are installed in the ground at roughly 10 to 20 feet around the perimeter of your structure. Inside those stations, we place a very special food source for termites, one that's actually preferred over their natural food. Termites enter the station, they begin feeding, they like it, they lay pheromone trails that attract their nest mates, so eventually you get a lot of termites feeding in that station. Technicians with pest management professional companies come by on a regular basis and check those stations. When they see that activity in the station, they replace it with the same kind of food, but this time with a slow-acting toxicant. Termites continue to feed, they share the food and the toxicant with their nest mates, and this leads to the control of the colony. Another Trelona ATBS option is called direct baiting. With this option, when you install the bait station, we put the bait in first. That's the special food source with the slow-acting toxin. This is a preferred option when there's already activity on the structure or around the perimeter of the structure. Now both of these options can be combined with a liquid treatment with Termidor HE. That can be done either as a spot treatment to where the termite activity is on the structure or as a full perimeter treatment. Another option is a system called Trelona ATBS Home Monitoring. This option is for homeowners who don't have termite activity in their home and they're not ready for it, deciding on a preventive treatment, but they still want to be aware if there's termite activity around their home. It works very similar to the first option. 
Stations are installed around the home. The special food source is put into the stations. It doesn't contain the slow-acting toxicant. Those stations are monitored by the pest management professional technician on a regular basis, and then when he sees that activity in those stations, he notifies the homeowner, and at that point, the homeowner can reevaluate their options for termite prevention. A home with an active termite infestation can cause a significant amount of damage in a short amount of time. So controlling them immediately is crucial to protecting your home. If a home is free of termites, termite prevention programs can be utilized to ensure the home stays termite free. To learn more about Termidor HE Liquid Termiticide, Trulona Advanced Termite Baiting System, or Trulona Advanced Home Monitoring System, visit termidorhome.com. To see this portion of the show again, go to designingspaces.tv and click on the BASF Termidor video. From understanding insurance and how it can protect your biggest investment, to visiting the latest trends in urban living and lifestyle, or protecting your new home from a destructive invader, we want you to be armed with the information that gives you the power to build a better home and lifestyle for you and your family. We are Designing Spaces. For more information about anything you've seen on today's show or to find out how to be part of the show, log on to designingspaces.tv. You can visit these websites to learn more about the participants on this edition of Designing Spaces.